All right, so we are back out in the community knocking on doors. And it's a skill that you have to master. It's a skill that you have to be courageous in. And we're going to actually walk around right now and uh, see what that skill looks like. Welcome to the world of corporate, corporate ambassadorship. So some of the things you want to get as when you're knocking on doors, you want to get in and out as quickly as possible while capturing as much information as you can. Information being who's your decision maker as far as their name, their telephone number, their email address, and really if you can get on their schedule, you know, what is the process to get on their schedule. Uh, you really want to focus on those things. Uh, outside of that, you want to look the part. I'm relaxed right now, but I've been doing this for over uh, five years. So ultimately, um, my business casual plus the art of communication can get you a long way. Let's go ahead and stop into the next one. Yeah. So, as you, okay, so in that situation, as you noticed, the door was closed or the, the sign said closed. But when you're knocking on doors, a lot of times you gotta take advantage of the opportunity that you have because ultimately the biggest factor you're losing is your time. You're physically out knocking on doors right now where you could be doing other things that could be making you money. So hold that thought, you're right back. So when you're door knocking, you're really investing in getting as much information during the door knock as you can because you're really wasting a lot of time by physically traveling door to door and getting information where you could possibly do a telephone call or you could do an email. But when you're doing an in-person visit, even if it is a cold call, it becomes more impressionable and you're able to get more out of the uh, initial uh, interaction. So uh, you want to get as much information. And I said that because a few minutes ago, a door, a sign on the door said closed, but we went on ahead and went in anyways and was able to get the information to who we needed to get it to. So sometimes you just got to go ahead and uh, defy the odds, kind of bend the rules a little bit so you can get things done. With that being said, what, what are some of the things that we want to have with us when we're knocking on door is our promotional material, whatever that is. Um, it could be a newsletter, it could be your sales uh, sheets, or it could be just uh, promotional information for a community activity. But you definitely want to make sure you have your uh, promotional material with you, a pen, paper, and business cards. You want to have those things with you because uh, those are the tools that you're going to need to get the information you need quickly and get out of there. Let's go on to the next one. How you doing? You're doing great, thank you. Uh, tell me about it. You're not an attorney, are you? No, sir. No, okay, gotcha. Pastor. Pastor, gotcha. Well, um... I'm trying to think of a good scripture, but I can't think of nothing other than Psalms 8 through 18 for some reason. But uh, uh, one of the things to my mind is I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. What scripture is that? Uh, I believe it's Philippians 3:14. So look, wait a second, Philippians 3:14. We're passing our invitation to you. I gave her. We always go back to the car. So one of the first reactions you're gonna get, one of the first reactions you're gonna get is, who are you, why are you here, what are you trying to sell me? So just know that going in, and you gotta be creative in your approach when you're talking to individuals. Uh, you want to clearly state, you know, uh, why you're stopping by, make it sound fun, bubbly, friendly. Um, and almost, if you can, worst case, you always wanna know, who do I connect to about this situation, whatever situation you're doing. And so, so one of, one of the things that we're doing today, it's a beautiful situation. One of the things that we're doing today is we're knocking on doors specifically for an industry. So if you're a corporate ambassador, you're going to get to know a lot of different industries uh, because you're gonna be meeting so many different people and this particular industry is dealing with uh, corrections, if you will. And so we're connected with all of the law firms and offices, which is pretty cool. How you doing, boss? All right. So one thing that we're doing as well is when you get your pen and paper, you either want to have a predetermined 
location or uh, places you want to go to or whenever you knock on doors you want to record actually where you're going so that way you're actually generating leads let's go on inside there's gonna be a few times where you're knocking and you're gonna see and, and see doors locked and people giving you strong no's as far as what you're delivering as far as your request but you got to keep knocking you got to keep moving forward keep a this is a new opportunity mindset every time you visit a door and don't be nervous or scared that things are going to go wrong or you're going to mess up it doesn't matter you're building relationships you're getting better in your skill you're going to get better every time so keep keep going